Hi, welcome to our Pharma Topics channel. Welcome to the topic on how genomics is useful in target discovery and target validation. So let us see what is genomics. Genomics is a branch of molecular biology that focuses on studying the structure, function, evolution and mapping of genomes. The genome is a complete set of organisms genetic material including all of its genes and non-coding DNA. Genomics involves analysis of DNA sequences to understand the genetic code and how it influences various biological processes. It involves DNA sequencing, identification of genes, identification of genomic variations, structural genomics, functional genomics, comparative genomics and utilization of bioinformatics. So, uh, for genomics, the base is the DNA and the central dogma, which is uh, invented by our Indian scientist, Dr. Harbgobind Korana. Uh, the structure of DNA is a double helix. The nucleosides, uh, that is ATGC, and nucleotides are with uh, tri triphosphate groups. DNA sequencing, uh, sequencing, it is the process of uh, determining the order of nucleotides in the DNA molecule that is uh, ATGC how it is arranged. This technology has evolved significantly over the years becoming faster and more affordable and enabling the researchers to sequence the entire genomes. So in the starting uh, the inventions were done by Maxim Gilbert sequencing the most famous uh, Sanger sequencing and nowadays it is automatic automated sequencing. What is a gene? Genes are specific sequences of DNA that contain the instructions for producing proteins or functional RNA molecules. They play a crucial role in determining the organism's characteristics and functions. So the genetic characteristics, they determine the phenotype of the organism. Uh, the disease pattern is based on the genetic pattern. So genome, uh, the uh, genomes uh, can vary between uh, individuals and these variations are responsible for different traits, susceptibility to diseases and responses to medications. So understanding the genomic uh, variation is essential for personalized medicine and precision healthcare. By using genomics, researchers can discover and validate a wide range of potential drug targets leading to development of new therapies and treatments for various diseases and conditions. Functional genomics. This field focuses on understanding how genes function and interact with each other within the context of the entire organism. It involves studying of gene expression, regulation and roles of non-coding DNA. By employing the functional uh, genomics and integrating them with other molecular data, researchers can gain valuable insights into the role of potential uh, drug targets in disease pathways. First one is structural genomics. Uh, this, area, this area of research aims to determine the three-dimensional structure of proteins and other biomolecules encoded by the genes. Knowing their structures uh, can aid in understanding their functions and potential interactions. Structural genomics helps to identify the potential drug targets by providing information on the three-dimensional structures of proteins which are involved in the disease pathways. These structures can be analyzed to identify the pockets or the binding sites on the protein surface that may be targeted by small molecular drugs or biologicals through virtual screening. Comparative genomics. Comparative genomics involves comparing the genomes of different species to understand the evolutionary relationships and identify the conserved regions or the genes with the shared functions. Comparative genomics also allows uh, researchers to identify the genes or pathways that are conserved across different species or organisms. If a particular gene is found to be conserved in multiple species and is associated with a disease phenotype, it increases the confidence that this gene may be relevant uh, target for therapeutic intervention. Bioinformatics Genomics generates vast amounts of uh, data making computational tools and bioinformatics techniques essential for analyzing and interpreting the information. These tools uh, help researchers uh, make sense of uh, genomic data and discover meaningful 
patterns. Bioinformatic tools allow researchers to integrate the data from different sources such as genomics, transcriptomics, proteomics database, clinical data sets and literature repositories. By combining the diverse or different data sets, the researchers can identify potential targets that are consistently dysregulated are associated with the disease across different levels of biological information. How genomics helps in target validation? Genomics plays a crucial role in target validation, which is the process of determining whether a particular molecule, usually a protein, is suitable target for therapeutic intervention. Target validation is a critical step in drug discovery and development, and it helps researchers to identify and prioritize potential drug targets that are likely to have a significant impact on treating a specific disease. Identification of disease relevant targets. Genomic studies such as genome wide association studies and expression profiling help identify genes and genetic variants that are associated with specific diseases. By analyzing the genomic data from uh, the different individuals with the disease and healthy controls, Researchers can pinpoint the potential target genes or proteins that may be involved in a disease development or progression. Genomics helps in understanding the gene function. Genomics provides information about the function of uh, genes and the associated proteins. Functional genomics techniques such as uh, RNA interference or CRISPR-Cas9 gene editing allows researchers to selectively knock down or modify the expression of target genes in uh, cell or animal models. This helps to establish a cause and effect relationship between the target gene and the disease phenotype, validating its relevance as a potential therapeutic target. Identifying druggable targets. Genomics helps identify the genes that encodes proteins amenable to drug targeting. Not all the genes and proteins are suitable for therapeutic intervention. But the genomic data can highlight uh, those genes that have right properties such as being expressed in the disease relevant tissues and having accessible binding sites for potential drugs. Biomarker discovery. Genomics can aid in the discovery of biomarkers, biological indicators that can predict the disease risk, progression or response to treatment. Biomarkers associated with a specific target can serve as an evidence uh, supporting the target's relevance for therapeutic intervention. Personalized medicine. Personalized means individualized therapy. Genomics enables the identification of genetic variants that influence the drug response in individuals. Understanding the, an individual's genetic makeup can help tailor treatments based on their genetic predisposition, improving the likelihood of successful outcomes. Prioritizing the targets. In drug discovery, there are often numerous potential targets, but the resources are limited. Genomics helps to prioritize the targets based on their relevance to the disease, potential druggability and likelihood of success in the clinic, increasing the efficiency of drug development process. Validation in human patient samples. Genomics data from patient samples can be used to validate the importance of uh, a target in a human disease context. Analyzing the gene expression, mutations or protein levels in patient tissues or biofluids can provide valuable insights into the target's involvement in the disease. Human Genome Project. These are some of the examples of the uh, the success of the genome projects in target uh, discovery and validation. The human genome project has revealed there are 23 chromosomes, 23 or 22 are allosomes and you have X and Y chromosomes. And the mouse genome project. This project was initiated to provide the researchers with a comprehensive and detailed map of genetic information present in the laboratory mouse which is one of the most widely used model organisms in biomedical research. The compilation of mouse genome project marked a significant milestone in the field of genomics and biomedical research. The availability of mouse genome sequence has since been a valuable resource for studying the genetic basis of various diseases 
understanding the gene functions and developing mouse models for human diseases the next project is uh, drosophila uh, genome project drosophila genome project also known as uh, fly based project it was a collaborative effort uh, aimed at uh, sequencing and analyzing the complete genome of the fruit fly drosophila melanogaster similar to other genome projects the drosophila genome project involved comparative genomics researchers compared the fruit fly genome with the other sequenced genomes including human genome to study the evolutionary relationships identify conserved genes and gain insights into genetic basis of human health and disease the next is puffer fish genome project puffer fish are of particular interest to scientists due to their unique characteristics including their ability to inflate themselves as a defense mechanism one well known species uh, is the japanese puffer fish fugu uh, rubrips beyond their intriguing behavior puffer fish also possess a relatively compact genome compared to other vertebrates the genome compactness combined with the presence of genes similar to those found in humans makes them valuable subjects for comparative genomics the next is c elegans uh, genome project Canarobitis elegans genome project also known as C elegans genome project was one of the pioneering effects in the field of genomics Canarobitis elegans is a tiny transparent roundworm that has been extensively studied as a model organism in biology it has a relatively simple and well defined anatomy a short life cycle and a fully mapped nervous system making it an ideal model for studying various biological processes and genetic mechanisms researchers continue to use this remarkable model organism to uncover new insights into fundamental biological process and human health publicly available uh, databases are some of uh, the databases one is uh, genbank uh, which is widely used a publicly accessible database contains the dna and the protein data sequence uh, developed by national institute of health Augustus is a bioinformatics software tool widely used for gene prediction and annotation in the genomic sequences. It is named after the Roman emperor Augustus as a nod to the task of predicting genes which can be seen as a ruling over the genomic sequence. The next is Ensemble uh, Genomic uh, Database. The database looks like this. It contains the all the gen genomes of different species which could be used for uh, widely for research the next is a dbsnp uh, it is a short genetic variation uh, all the uh, single included polymorphisms of different genes can be utilized from this database publicly available other databases are a genome scan also known as a genome wide scan or genome wide association study is a powerful uh, technique used in genetics and genomic uh, diseases to identify the genetic variations associated with specific traits or diseases sage database uh, is a bioinformatics resource that provides uh, information on gene expression patterns in various tissues and cells sage was one of the early techniques used to quantitatively analyze gene expression on large scale next is uh, vista it is a bioinformatics uh, resource uh, that provides access to collection of regulatory elements and their associated functional data in the genome it is a valuable resource for studying the regulation of gene expression identification of enhancers in the various uh, biological process involving development tissue specific uh, gene expression and diseases of various species so it's a very short uh, nutshell of uh, uh, the all the information related to how genomics is useful in target discovery and validation I hope it will be useful for you. Thank you for listening. Happy learning. Kindly share this to more of your friends. If you like this uh, video, kindly press the like button. Go through all the series of videos and uh, score well in your exams in um, principles of drug discovery. Thank you.